Today, Dr. Ferrer said that more and more people are being tested each day. She also said that healthcare workers and first responders who do not have any symptoms are being tested, and that program is well underway starting today. And there was this. More people are dying uh, each day from COVID-19 than from other diseases uh, that we track uh, and get information on. The death toll from COVID-19 in LA County is now just under 800. From April 12th to the 23rd, which is a couple of weeks, there were 535 deaths related to COVID-19. And this represents 67% of all of our COVID deaths that we've had that happened just in a two week period. She said on average in the county each day, five people die from the flu, eight from respiratory ailments, 31 from heart disease, and now, comes this virus. At the average rate of 44 deaths for COVID-19, COVID-19 has now become the lead co leading cause of death across the county. She said there are nearly 1,900 people hospitalized today because of this virus. 29% of them in the ICU, 19% of that number on ventilators. Across the county, the number of people uh, in the last two months that have died from COVID-19 is greater than the number of people that died from in influenza over the past eight months flu season. She drew attention to these numbers to hammer home a point. The stay at home orders now in the sixth week must remain in place. The heat is here. The temptation will be great to go to other counties where you can go to the beach or golf and take advantage of less restrictions than are here in LA County. And she said again, Please think about it. It's not an either or situation, but I think uh, most public health people would agree at the point that you have more people close to each other and in contact with each other, uh, we will have more cases. So the message is quite clear. If you are going to wander out, please don't forget about the precautions. From downtown Los Angeles, Dave Lopez, KCON 9 News.